y'all, this is Charity from Frog Crochet, and our devotion for today, Strong in the Lord. The Lord is my strength and song, and he is become my salvation. Exodus 15.2 When women think of strength, we seldom think in terms of power, lifting, or muscle building. We're much more likely to think in terms of an emotional stability or resilience. Take Linda, for instance. Her son has required surgery after surgery since his birth 10 years ago. Linda has spent countless hours in the intensive care unit. She has dried countless tears both her son's and her own. Linda keeps exploring medical options, keeps reassuring concerned teachers and grandparents. They all consider Linda a tower of strength. Or take Marcy. When her husband died a dozen years ago, Marcy moved to a retirement home. She seldom sees her children. One lives halfway across the country and the other halfway around the world. But Marcy keeps busy encouraging others in her apartment complex, especially those who are new and feeling lost. Marcy's friends consider her a rock. Every life has its share of troubles, turmoil, and tragedy. We make our plans, but life keeps on happening despite them. We may try to get by relying on our own stubbornness or on a positive attitude. We may look to the goodwill, the skills, or the wisdom of other people to pull us through. We may simply put our heads down and muddle along one step at a time. Sooner or later, though, we learn how feeble these approaches really are, how little people or how little help they provide, especially over the long haul. So, where does true strength, enduring strength, come from? If you ask both Linda and Marcy, they will tell you that they have learned to rely on a source of strength outside themselves. They have learned to lean on Jesus. This does not mean denying or ignoring other distress or its effects. It does mean keeping the whole truth in mind including the strength of our Savior and his promises to see us through. We focus on him and not on our problems or on our own abilities to overcome them. We remember, the Lord is my strength and song, and he is become my salvation. Exodus 15:2. And our prayer is, Lord Jesus, put a song of praise in my heart today as I learn to lean on you for strength. Alrighty, y'all have a wonderful and blessed day. And we will see y'all next time. Bye, y'all.